Good morning everyone. Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel Cobru News. Today I have a special person uh, Mr. GB Harbar Young from Naisingpara and this place can uh, today we are going to discuss uh, about uh, brew uh, and sorry uh, which was uh, ha incident happened in Damchera on 27 uh, July 2021 and today I'm going to ask him what, uh, some question. Uh, what is the what is the reason behind uh, the conflict between Choroi and Bru? Please, could you possible to uh, tell me from the beginning to till the end? Thank you very much for inviting me in your studio, and I would like to uh, tell you some uh, information or news about uh, uh, last. July 13, July 27 incident that is uh, took place in Kaskau village. So the main reason behind the incident is not the incident was not uh, actually happened on that day. It was uh, already happened before three times. That is the last incident that is uh, known by everybody. But before that also. The incident was took place in Kaskaupara, but that is not response by the villager. So the first incident that is uh, took place in 13 of Ju July 2021. On that night, uh, around 8 p.m., uh, Thangram Indigenous Movement and Chorai Young Chorai Organization, they these two organization they come and attack the tree. Kaskau villager, but the Kaskau villager do not fight back. They simply keep quiet and the problems, the incident has been uh, finished. And again, a second time, that is on the 16th of uh, July 2021, uh, the Young Chorai Association, this Chorai community, they come and uh, place a poster. In the poster, it is written, uh, Rulngam Kwa. Ral ngam kwa. Ral ngam means that is ral means enemy and uh, ngam means uh, challenge. Under this uh, this banner has been uh, placed in the near the Kaskau village. And again, the Kaskau villagers do not uh, express anything about this incident. On 18th of July 2021. Again, they came and attacked the Kaskau villager. On this uh, incident, FIR also has been lodged in the police station, and peace meeting also has been conducted in the video video office. But no arrest, no nothing has happened. No uh, law and order has been taken. Uh, I think because uh, no Chorai uh, are arrested. Those who are disturbing, those who are making the problems. Those people were not arrested by the police. So, and this meeting also has been conducted between the two community. But after conducting the peace meeting on 27th of July, uh, again the Chari community are attacking the Bru community. So, in the fourth time, the Bru community also could not tolerate. Could not tolerate. That's why they fight back. In those fight back, in this incident, most of the brew youth also has been injured. And some Chorai youth also has been injured. Some Chorai house has been burned down. And some uh, garden also has been uh, destroyed. So that is the last incident. That is the fourth time. So the Kaskau villager, the brew community, these people are tolerate tolerating for many times these two community Kaskau villager and the five quarter villager they are living together in this uh, area in this Damchera area for many years from 1997 till uh, last week so there is no any communal conflict between the two community but after the agreement was signed in the Delhi, the resettlement agreement was signed, signed in Delhi. And Kaskau Relief Camp also has been selected as one of the settlement area. 
after that, the Chari community are planning uh, to disturb the resettlement process. That is, they don't want the their area, that area, to be occupied by the Bru community. So because of that, the problems, the conflict has been uh, took place. According to the information given by the villagers or some intellectual person of the Kaskov village. Okay, uh, let me ask you one one more question. Um, how many Choroi's youth are injured? Please could you tell me? Okay. If any incident, any fighting is took place, some injury is there possible, because according to the information I got from the uh, doctors and the Kaskov villagers, uh, brew youth, seven, eight brew youths were injured seriously, and six, sorry, youth were injured seriously. In this uh, case also, uh, from according to the government, they will aid, they will give in some compensation, I mean some uh, fees, some money to the victims, some money to the injured person, but till today, according to the injured person, they didn't get any financial help from the government also. Okay. Uh, we had that, some of the information uh, given by the villager that we had uh, 1,327 family are refugee in Assam, Manikbon, Magura, uh, Pan, uh, Pathar Gandhi district in Assam. That is uh, real or truth? Please, could you uh, tell me? Yeah, many news channel, print media or electronic media, flash that uh, 1,270 uh, Chorai were displaced in Assam. So that is the wrong information. According to the video of Damchera and some uh, intellectual person, I got the exact number of the Chorui population is 630, only 630, but most of the media, they flash that it is around 1,270, that is not correct. So exact population of the Faikwa Chorui population is 630. In this incidence, many news and media are focusing uh, only about the force of brew. It is uh, wrong or right. Please, could you uh, tell me the truth? Yes, yeah, that is uh, partly correct, we can say. But before that, most of the media are focusing only about one side. So, according to those media, Bru are false. It is the guilty of the Bruce. But it is not correct. Any media, any news channel, let them come and visit the spot, that is the Kasko village, let them take interview to the villager, who is the false. But instead of that, only listening from one side and retain, writing in the newspaper or flashing in the news, that is not good, that is not correct. This will not make communal harmony. So according to the some newspaper, all the blame come to the brew community, brew displaced from Mizoram. So that is not good. We are not happy to those newspaper, those uh, media who are reporting like that. So false or guilty is not only the blue community, it is the sorry community also is there. So let them, before writing in the newspaper, before flashing in any news, let them come and visit the spot. Let them, let them have spot verification also. After that, let them plus or let them write in the newspaper. Otherwise, simply blaming the poor and illiterate community, especially the community, that is not good. So what is written in newspaper, mostly it is wrong. All the blames are not only the community, it is the Chari community that they took. It is that they begin the incident first. So, 
And the government also we should not take in one side. If the government also hearing only one side, one community means Tripura will not be a peaceful state. And between Soroy and Bru also will not have any uh, communal harmony. So if the situation is going on like that means instead of making communal harmony, it will broke out a communal violence between the two communities. So in order to stop the communal violence between the community, so the government or any media, they should come first and investigate. They should know the truth first. After that, let them flash or write news in uh, any way. So that is what we request to the uh, media also. Okay. Thank you very much for visiting my studio and Kovru News. Thank you for your coming. God bless you. Thank you for watching. Thank you.